get overheated, and everyone can still stay warm once they get moving. Stamp second and ten. Lloyd Lewis looked like he jumped outside. Johnson throws complete to Wheeler. He's down at the 41-yard line. Calvin Lovell came up to make the tackle, but there was a penalty flag. Procedure, Calgary 68. Kerry Ilarenko drew Lloyd Lewis offside. The penalty against the Stampeders will likely be declined by the Ottawa Rough Riders, and they will force Calgary into a punting situation on third down and three. The silly mistakes still hound the Stampeders and early in the game. No real reason to go offside like that or to move early. We will once again time these punts from the time the ball is snapped until the time it lands in the arms of the receiver. And coaches tell us anything over six seconds in that area is considered good. Glenn Harper's first kick of the game is not a good one. It bounces at the 40. Will Lewis with it at the 37. And he has stopped right there. Now with the bounce, uh, the time turned out pretty well. But Harper did not hit one of his really good kicks. Well, the important thing about the hang time, and they look for about four seconds, is that it allows the team to go down and cover. A driving punt that will oftentimes can for force a returner to backpedal can be a good kick, but it can work out against you because now the returner has a chance to run to the wall or get a good return because there's a good space in there. Bruno Jeremiah handled that punt by Glenn Harper. Ottawa Rough Riders with the football for the first time. Todd Dillon, their quarterback, starts from his 37-yard line. And he hands off to Cedric Mitter, who was hit immediately and then is pulled down. Quincy Williams got through to make the first contact. Jeffers and Sandy Armstrong playing his first game with the Stamps, helping out. The Stamps on defense have been pretty good despite their record. The Ottawa Rough Riders feel they can run some plays against them and get up the seam in between those four down linemen. That's what Fred Glick is looking to do today. Second down and 10 yards to go. The Ottawa Rough Riders no gain on that first play. They're at their 37-yard line. Dillon back to pass. Flags down. Dillon gets the ball off, but with the pressure, nowhere near the intended receiver, James Hood. But there are penalty flags on the play. You know, it's interesting, Calgary, you say, Neil, better defensively than their record would indicate. They've given up 248 yards, an average of 248. Offside, Calgary 32. Offside against the Stampeders. The Calgary's given up an average of 248 passing yards per game, which is the second lowest total in the Canadian Football League. You wouldn't think that of a team one and six. No, you wouldn't. And they have been on the field an awful lot because of the turnovers. They've had 42 turnovers this year after seven games. You'd think that that, would be, that total would be higher. Well, in that takeaway giveaway category, the Stampeders' record is minus 21, and that's just a, a horrible average in that statistics. And the Ottawa Rough Riders will have second down over after the offside penalty against Calgary and Dillon finds a receiver open up at the 54 but he couldn't hang out of the ball. James Hood diving back for it 